Hello everyone, in this topic we will look at how to install Grab Customizer on Ubuntu 24.04. Now Grab Customizer is a handy graphical tool that lets you configure various aspects of the Grab bootloader without directly editing the Grab configuration file on the command line. You can use the Grab Customizer tool to add or remove boot entries. You can also set the default operating system modify kernel parameters and change the appearance of the grab menu by adding a background image. And like I mentioned, you can do all of this without directly editing the grab configuration file from the command line. Now let's get started. So this is how my grab menu looks like. So I'm currently running a dual boot setup with Ubuntu set as the default operating system. Now you can see the fifth entry on the list. This is indicated as Windows Boot Manager and this is the entry that lets me boot into the Windows operating system. So we are going to install Grab Customizer and later on set the default operating system to Windows. And we shall also try to set a wallpaper or a background image to spice up the Grab menu. So let's get started. To install Grab Customizer, the first step is to update the local package index and to do so, open your terminal and run the command sudo apt update and hit enter. So this will update the local package index and as you can see, we are done. Now the next step is to install the package itself. Now by default, Grab Customizer is not available or hosted on the default Ubuntu repositories. So what you need to do is to add the Grab Customizer PPA. So I'm gonna go to my web browser here. Now what you need to do is search for Launchpad PPA for Grab Customizer and select this first option that appears. So I'm going to open this in a new tab. So this directs you to the Launchpad PPA for Grab Customizer and this is a PPA by Daniel Richer. All right. So this provides you with the instructions on how you can install Grab Customizer. All right. So we have updated the local package index. Now the next step is to add the PPA. So I'm going to copy this, head back to my terminal and I'm going to run this command to add the PPA to my system. So I'm going to hit enter. All right. So as you can see, the PPA contains the latest release of Grab Customizer. All right. And lists the instructions on how to go about adding or installing the Grab Customizer. So to enter or rather to continue, I'm simply going to hit enter. So this adds the PPA to my sources list. And as you can see, this is ongoing. And that is done. All right. Now the next step is to update the local package index so that the system can start using the PPA. So once again, I'm going to run the command sudo apt update and hit enter. So as you can see on this entry, you can see the system is synchronizing the PPA and uh, in a few seconds, this will be complete and uh, that is done. All right. So now I'm going to install Grab Customizer using the apt package manager by running the command sudo apt install grab hyphen customizer like that. So I'm going to hit enter. So you can see the list of packages to be installed. All right. So to proceed, I'm simply going to type Y on the keyboard and hit enter. So this will install grab customizer alongside other packages and dependencies. So just give it a few seconds for the installation to complete. And as you can see, we are almost done. And there we go. We have successfully installed Grab Customizer on Ubuntu 24.04. Now, the next step is to launch the 
grab customizer tool so you can head over to the left bottom corner and click on this icon here which shows the installed applications and on the search bar simply type grab and when you type grab it will simply uh, show you the grab customizer icon as you can see here all right so i'm simply going to click on this to launch it now you'll be required to authenticate using your password and i'm going to do exactly that and i'm gonna hit enter and in a short while the grab customizer graphical interface will appear as you can see all right so i'm just going to make it a little bit bigger okay so here you can see on the list configuration this provides you with the grab entries in order so as we saw earlier uh, ubuntu is the default operating system and this is first on the list followed by advanced options for ubuntu now here you can see this is my windows entry so it's labeled windows boot manager okay now on these settings here you can see these are the general settings and for the appearance settings nothing is configured so far all right so we mentioned that you can use the grab customizer to modify boot entries and you can set the default operating system so here the default is ubuntu but i want to set windows manager as my default uh, boot entry so i'm simply going to highlight this by clicking on this and selecting the arrow up button here so this will move the entry up okay so i'll continue pressing this until it gets to the top here so as you can see we have set a windows boot manager as the default operating system to boot into okay now another thing i would like to do is to customize the appearance settings by changing the background so i'm gonna go over to the appearance settings here okay then i'm going here to the background image section so i'm gonna click on this icon so this takes me to this section here so i'm going to navigate to where i have saved a wallpaper or a background so i'm going to click other locations then uh, i'm going to click a home so here for root i'm going to click on this then click on this icon so i'm going to navigate to where i have saved the wallpaper so i'm going to navigate to the download section here and i'm going to select new but wallpaper dark so this is a, a dark wallpaper or a grayscale wallpaper and as you can see it presents you with a preview of what i will have once i have saved the changes all right so this is what will appear once i have saved the changes and rebooted my system okay so with that i'm going to click the save icon here to save the changes and this will also create a grab a new grab configuration file so i'm gonna select save and below here you can see the configuration is being updated so just wait for a few seconds for the changes to be effected and we are done okay so what i'm gonna do at this point i'm going to close out the grab customizer window all right so here i'm going to reboot my system and we shall see shortly how my grab menu entry looks like so i'm going to reboot this and i'll be back in a few seconds so the system is about to reboot and there we go so as you can see now the grab menu looks different this time around and as you can see the first entry is the windows boot manager like we configured and the second entry is ubuntu all right 
So as you can see, uh, you can use Grab Customizer to modify various aspects. You can modify the boot order. You can also modify the background image of the Grab menu as, we, as you have seen. All right. So that's about it for this lecture, guys. See you in the next lecture.